So my name is Carlos Hernandez. Thank you for coming. Today, um, how about let's start by you introducing yourself. What do you do? What is it that you do? My name is Lizzie, and I am the youth media instructor here at Independent Filmmaker Project Minnesota. Hey, I'm Elena, and I'm an intern at Juice Media. <laughs> my name is Ethan Shield. All right. So today I will be asking you several questions that may or not may hurt your brain. But don't worry because I will tell you the right answers at the end. Since there will be several contestants, uh, the participant with the most correct answers wins. Shall we start? Let's go. There's only one cash though. You only have about 30 seconds or less to answer each question. To begin with, a truck driver is going down a one-way street the wrong way and passes at least 10 cops. Why is, why is he not caught? Uh, why is he not caught? Um, not actually driving a car. Final answer? Yeah. Because it was a cop car. A little girl kicks the soccer ball. It goes 10 feet and comes back to her. How is this possible? Uh, she's kicking at a wall. Final answer? Yeah. She kicked it against the wall. Final answer? Yep. A rooster laid an egg on top of the barn roof. Which way did it roll? Roosters don't lay eggs. Um, it didn't. If you had only one match and entered a dark room containing an oil lamp, some newspaper, and some kindling wood, which would you light first? Not the match, because I would go out too soon. I guess I'd light the oil. Final answer? Sure. I'd like the paper first, then the lamp, and then the kindling one. An electric train is moving north at 100 miles per hour, and the wind is blowing to the west at 10 miles per hour. Which way does the smoke blow? Uh, oh, electric trains don't have smoke. <laughs> Where's the wind coming from? The wind is coming from the west. Then the smoke blows. What has a head and a tail, but no body? A penny. Some months have 31 days, others have 30 days. How many have 28 days? One. February. Sometimes. Sometimes. Sometimes? It's... Okay. <laughs> if there are 12 fish and a half, and, a, and half of them drown, how many are there left? They can't drown the fish. <laughs> how far can you walk into the woods? Walk very far. How far can you walk into the woods? Yes. I don't know, however long the woods are. How many times can you subtract 10 from 100? You can infinite. Infinite times? Yeah, you just keep going negative. Okay. How much dirt is there in a hole 3 feet deep, 6 feet long, and 4 feet wide? None, because it's a hole. Enough to fill up that hole. If it took eight men ten hours to build a wall, how long would it take four men to build it? Uh, twenty. Final answer? Sure. <laughs> and last but not least, imagine you are sinking in a rope boat surrounded by sharks. How would you survive? I'd use my work to just stab all the sharks. Larry's father has five sons, named 10, 20, 30, 40. Guess what would be the name of the fifth? I don't know. Uh, 50. Uh, uh, so now that you answered all the questions, I will be telling you the answers. So, to tell you, the first question was, a truck driver is going down a one-way street the wrong way and passes at least 10 cops, why is he not caught? The actual answer was because he was not driving, he's walking on the sidewalk. And the third question I asked you, if you had only one match and entered a dark room containing an oil lamp, some newspaper and kindling wood, which would you like first? You were close to answering it. You said it can't be the match, which in fact it is a match. If it took eight men 10 hours to build a wall, how long would it take four men to build it? You said 20 hours, correct? Mm -hmm. uh, that's wrong because it's no time at all since the wall is already built. Uh... And last question is, how far can you walk into the woods? 
I forgot your answer, but the correct way is halfway because after that you're walking out of the woods. And lastly, uh, I asked you how many times can you subtract 10 from 100? You said infinite times, but the correct answer is once. Next time you would be subtracting 10 from 90. Oh, smart. I think you got two, questions, two answers out of eight. Okay. Yeah, let's just say you have two, correct. You got six out of eight, I believe, so yeah. So that's, uh, let's see, that's over 50%, I know yeah. that. So congratulations, any last words? That was, that was good. Uh, thank you for having me. No problem. That was a lot of fun. <laughs>